Salutations everyone, my name is Fucat, and welcome back to Akamanto. So in the last playthrough, I did get the escape ending. I wasn't really sure what happened with the colorful papers, so what I decided to do was not record off screen a few hours ago to replay this and ignore the colorful papers to see if I would get the same ending. Turns out, it was the same ending, so that means that whatever I did with the shrine and the colorful papers did not come into effect. So that means I'm going to try to get this into effect by doing some other stuff. So this is going to be a quick video. Let's go ahead and just jump right into it. Alright, so I currently have six papers. We only have one more paper to go, I believe. So now we'll go ahead and go into the well where that guy is. And uh, he'll give me the blue paper. And then what I'm going to do is speak to him again since I did not do that last time. So turn that on. No sign of Akka, which is a good sign. Though it doesn't make this video intense for that matter. Alright, so now we'll go ahead and just go straight and speak to him. Oh yeah, that's right. We also need to get the yen. I think I left the yen over here. So there's three yens overall, as far as I've found. Also, looking around, I haven't found all the other tape recorders. I don't know where they're at. I've looked meticulously. Have not found a thing that's new. Hello, yes, yes, we already know. You need a coin. Alright, thank you. Give me that. Alright, what do you have to tell me? A secret. There is a way to kill Akamanto. If you offer papers with all colors of the rainbow to a shrine, you may be able to get rid of him. Wish you luck. Hee hee hee. Oh, I got another achievement. Wishing well. Okay. So I think we got all the colors. I mean, the last one was a green one, right? And like, all colors of the rainbows is... Is that a spider? Huh, that's odd. I've never encountered a spider before. Okay, well that's all I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna walk over it. I'll close this just in case. Don't know if Akka's coming. So that's two down. Guess while this is going on, I'll digress. Talk about topics for the channel. Such as the spider being gone. But not that. So chickens just came in today. It's the very last vlog, so I am going to be recording a five week long vlog. To end the era. Since I'm not going to be living up in the chicken farm much longer. And I think it's going to be a lot of fun. In the aftermath of the chicken farm era, I will be taking some hiking trips, so I'm very excited for that. We passed the inspection, so I cannot be any more happy. Uh, what else? Cheat day. Next cheat day, I'm not really sure. I'm like in the 140s still, so I gotta cut down. Get myself back in the 130s so I can do the cheat day again. That's pretty much what I'm following. Do I have any more papers? I already put them all in. Really? Alright, what else do I have left? Just this? I hope I put it in. Hope I didn't drop it or something. Alright. Ah, that was it! Okay. So, it turns out you do have to talk to the person in the well for this to actually come into effect. So now we're gonna go ahead and kill Akka with a sword. Oh, that is most exciting. Next cheat day, though? Man, I'm so excited for that. Eating like the old me for a day. Man, I ate a lot of garbage back then. Wait, do I have to go look for Akka? Does he not, like, spawn somewhere? Now we're close by. Where are you, Akka? Alright, I gotta remember. Okay. I gotta... Ooh. Uh, where? Did I win? Oh, I did. I thought I died. Oh no! Anka went through the wall. It is a spirit. Well, case closed. Whew. 
That made me really nervous for a second. I thought I died. It's a permadeath. Remember that. I hate that. Why can't you just have the sword and the lighter in your hand at the same time? The deed was done. The girl stood completely still for a while, just staring at the velvet red cloak that now lay before her. So yeah, we finally got the next ending. Suddenly, as she finally realized what she had done, she started to run without ever looking back. The next day felt like any other. Maybe it was just a dream, the girl thought, but the ringing sensation in her hand told her otherwise. The fact that she stabbed a man with her own two hands, it was too surreal for her to believe. Was that person even human, or was it something else? It was a spirit. You saw it go through the wall. <laughs> she had to go back to that abandoned school building. She had to confirm what had really happened. I mean, you saw it. I mean, I'm trying to be quixotic here. The school building was exactly as she remember remembered, except just one thing. The body wasn't there, no evidence of it being moved or being cleaned up after either. There all these gnats. Just gone, vanished into the air like nothing had ever happened. The girl returned home. She lay in bed, staring into the darkness, just trying to make sense of it all. Months have passed since the last serial killing had been a known slasher, and there was no sign of it ever appearing again. The rumor of the slasher spread and soon became a popular urban legend amongst teenagers. Now, I, I do apologize for all the stuttering. They started to call the slasher, aka Monto, and he is said to be mass spirit who wears a red cloak and who appears to people using school uniforms restrooms if only these gnats would just cut it out but no one is certain if the legend was based off of a true story or not so yeah hopefully i get lion eyes for this and hopefully i can kill all of the gnats out here i'm i'm about to order something online to get rid of all these bullcrap gnats i'm so sick and tired of this what is it like four videos now Okay, Akamanto killed, cool. Oh, I completed it in 25 minutes. Huh. Said it to only be lasted like 190 or 30 minutes. And that was a good ending, I got the achievement. Alright, so I hope you all enjoyed this playthrough of Akamanto. Um, pretty sure this wraps it up. I think those are only two endings. There's no hidden ending as far as I'm concerned. Food ticket, I don't really know what that does. All it says is that it's not useful at the moment, and it doesn't seem to proceed any further from there. But yeah, 25 minutes. I was not expecting to festinate that quickly through this session. That is going to take a lot longer, but from what it seems, you don't have to use the anatomy bodies at all. Just going for the anatomy bodies just sends you to the rope, which leads you to the bad ending. So just go straight to looking for the papers. Um, in a way, you do have to go to the bad ending pathway because you gotta go get the green paper, but that's about it. Don't use the rope at that point. Just go straight to getting all the papers and you're good to go. Go back to the shrine, talk to the guy in the well first because he does make it come into effect, which is kind of ridiculous. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much the end of Akamanto. I hope you all enjoyed and I'll see you all in the next video. Stay awesome, kiddie saviors.